thank you so much, and welcome to the third annual National Small Talk Convention. How are you? How are you? Hi, how are you? Hi, how are you? Three years, I can't believe it's been that long. Back then, the weather was not as warm as it is today. It's a little warmer, kind of warm. A lot of construction going up. It's true. I'd like to bring up one of the founding members of the Small Talk organization, Ms. Erica Kern. Thank you so much. Got my haircut the other day. Um, yeah, I went to a, a new guy, and uh, yeah, he recommended a, a new conditioner, which I, I think, yeah, it's, it, I think it is working better. We have some great events coming up. Um, pointing at someone else's kid and saying, aw. Oh, tomorrow morning, uh, just nice, nice. Also, uh, Sunday. Uh, yeah, hold, uh, hold on just a second. Hey, uh, is there a Sally here? Or is, is this not the Public Comedy Bits convention? No, that's next week. That is embarrassing. OK. Uh, and uh, I am backing out awkwardly. It's beep, beep. I like her shoes, those are new. <laughs> okay, so, so this, this is what my name would be then. It would be Fabricio Stuyvesant. Isn't that a fun game? <laughs> you guys took car services here of some kind, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. There, there's a way to see your rating as a passenger. Really? Drivers rate you, just like you rate drivers. Huh? They rate yes, you? Yes, they all do it. Open up the app and then check, check my rating. Hmm. And mine is... 5.0. Oh, well, this is why you wanted to play the game. <laughs> yeah, I, I have I bragging really. rights. Right? Sure. I earned it. Okay, we get it. I'm a good passenger. Great what job. You got? 4.8. You both have 4.8. I got a 4.6. Oh. It's okay. That's fine. Do you ever argue with the driver, like what direction to take? If they're going the wrong way or something, sure. But... Ah, that's usually what it is. Like you, you have to sort of like play it cool with them. <laughs> 5.0 in your face, in your face. That's a 5.0. Calm down, Miliak, like an adult. Of a 4.6 should be telling me how to behave. I... It's wow. not a moral barometer. It is. It's how you treat other people. It's very insignificant. It's very insignificant and silly, but Carrie, we haven't heard your rating yet. That doesn't matter. I don't. I... Did you check it? Just go into settings. It can't be worse than a 4.6, um, right? Mm. Can I get the, the check? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Um, it's, it's not even a big deal. 3.1. I can't hear you. I didn't see it. This is a, a 3.1. I'm sorry, she's all the way over there in this breakfast noise. It's a 3.1! Okay? Are you guys satisfied? Who cares? Who cares? Um, we're taking off. Yeah, yeah, you guys are leaving. Yeah, yeah. we just we gotta That's take right. off. Yeah. We'll see you Tuesday, I think, right? Yeah, Is that what's yeah, Tuesday. <laughs> Sorry. Three point one. I didn't even think they could rate that low. Could you help me get my rating up? Because I don't want to be shunned by my friends. Okay. We're gonna get your score up, but you have to follow my lead. Okay. The way we're gonna start is I'm gonna call this car. I'm nervous. Don't be nervous. Okay. We're all paid up. I think we're ready to go. Here we are. I'm, I'm sweating. You have a 5.0 in the sweat department. Yes. And here we go. Okay. <laughs> Larry, thanks for coming in today. 
You know, as people move up in this company, you need to teach them how to let employees go, how to fire people. Am I getting fired? No, Larry. Um, this is a training session for you. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. All right, great. So that's why we bring in a local actor. This is Matthew. Hi, Larry. Larry, hello. But I'm going to be firing Matthew. Exactly. And, you know, to make it easier, why don't you guys switch places? Oh, all right. You know, Matthew's going to toss out a few scenarios for you. He's going to give you some practice. I've never done this before. Take your time. You'll do great. Right, don't feel sorry for me. I don't. That's the key to the whole thing. Okay. <laughs> there. Hey, Matthew, uh, thank you for coming in today. I I'm, I'm sorry, but there is no longer a position here for you at this firm. You're gonna fire me? The company's going through a lot of- I have three children, buddy. One's one, one's 40, all right? You know how much that costs? How old are you? I got a 40-year-old who's trying to buy a house, and you're gonna fire me? Matthew, there is no longer a position here at the company, and so I am terminating your employment as of now. <laughs> Bleedle, bleedle, the Beatles, the Beatles. Why am I here? I've never been upstairs, sir. Uh, I'm usually down working in, in, in the factory. Matthew, have you been taking classes? Private classes, which yeah, is great. Yeah, it's very effective. Dude, by the way, you're doing great. Thank you. What's your name again? Larry. Larry? <laughs> you believe in scripture? Scripture says that God does not do unto being fired and the employees of Ye. We have a very generous severance package which should help you and your Catholic children with whatever you may need. You don't want to fire me because I'm good at math. I theorems. All kinds of Canadian math problems. I think Canadian math is pretty much the same as American math. I'm threatening you, man. I'm going to throw a couple knives at you. I got them right here underneath the table. Matthew, there's no longer a position. No! Never! You signed a contract. There's just no longer a position for you here at the company. I could, I could do like web videos. Matthew. Actually, no, let, been... let him finish. You can do what kind of videos? So I could do little shorts. I could do a little series of six episodes. Okay. So my friend has like a little camera and it does sound too. So it looks really lo-fi, you know, like fast edits. Like, oh, I love you know, that Cut stuff. to the one guy, then it cuts to the two wow. guys, and then cut to the three guys, and then just do the joke at the end. It kind of looks rough around the edges, but like that's kind of the charm of it. You know, we really need someone like that. Nadine, that's that's pretty much what I do. No, but I could do it on the cheap because I got a friend so who can, can do, do it. it. He can do it on the cheap, though. And I think I'd like to give you a raise if you're if you're able to do that. So congratulations. I'm not, I'm not sure what's happening now. I just gave him a raise. Yeah, you did. Yeah. I failed. Ugh. I know. I wanted to stop you. It was really tough. You're so convincing. He's really good. And I'm such a, a sucker for content. Fred, here he is. Wait, wait, slow down. Oh. Don't be too enthusiastic. You know what I mean? You could be oh. pleasant, but they're rating you as soon as they see you. Okay. So a little smile, and let's just go in calmly. Okay. There we go. Let's sit in the front, you mind? <laughs> hey, man, hey. how are you? Hello. Hey. Hi, wow, what a nice car. <laughs> it's so clean. What's up, man? How are you? You look good. You know the destination, so make your way any way that you see fit. Your eyes are on the road. You're not even using your GPS, are you? You're not. That's fantastic. Hey, man, you're thirsty? I have a bottle of water here in my pocket. That's a gift for you. See, that's the shirt I was telling you about, Carrie. The one I wanted to get that is, like, really expensive looking and makes everyone look really handsome. This chair is great. Where'd you get this chair? Some Russian flags. Are you from Russia? conditioner. <laughs> <laughs> That was a great ride. Thank you so much. Great work. Thank you. All right, so here we go. Wait for it. Five stars. Well, I feel like I'm ready to do it. You're gonna do it? Yep. Here it comes, look. Philot. Philot? No. That's Philip with an F. Oh, okay. Well, I'll write in the front this time. You write in the back. No, you're on your own. You're gonna do this solo. I believe in you. All right. Here's some water. The key is to agree. Okay. That's the important part, okay? okay. Whatever he says, go along with it. Agree. Thank you. Hey. Uh, so, how are you today? I'm all right. I can't complain. Good. Um, it smells great in here. It's kind of a 
good. Sweet and sour, actually. Yeah, somebody threw up in the back last night. I thought I got it all out. I'm sorry. Well, you did. I mean, you, you got it out. I didn't notice it, personally. Um, would, would you like a water? I, I, I brought you a water. Are you giving me water? Yeah. <laughs> uh, you got water right there. Ah, thanks. <laughs> we both have water. Get the AC up. I, I just wanted to let you know that you could turn the air conditioning on if you'd like. Really? Yeah, yeah. Well, most chicks I know are always cold, you know? Weaker sex and whatnot. Remember, the key is to agree. I mean, they need <laughs> shawls and the heat to be on. and <laughs> It's it's because they're weaker. Really? Because I was kind of like half joking when I said that. But, uh... I, I was not joking. <laughs> Hey, I got a joke for you. What's the difference between driving over here and driving in Japan? What? Well, over here, you got your wife on the right-hand side going, rah, 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 rah. and in Japan, your wife is on your left-hand side going, rah, 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 rah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Yes. What is so funny about that is that it's true. Wow. <laughs> I got to say, I had you pegged all wrong. And when I saw you get in the car, I went, okay, here's a typical Portland liberal pro-choice feminazi. But you are cool. I am cool. I'm none of those things. Hey, you know, you never told me where you wanted to go. Oh, well, that's because I'm just kind of along for, for your ride, for your day. So you just want to hang out? Yeah. With me? Sure. Go where I want to go? Whatever you want to do. I'm, I'm here for you. <laughs> okay. I'm here for you. I was going to make a stop at a gun store in a little bit because I haven't been there in a while. Uh, I mean, you don't want to do that, do you? You love guns. I love guns. I love guns. So you want to come with me? Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I totally do. Wow, you're the best. <laughs> Just kidding. Of course, it would not be loaded. you to scoot down a little bit. Get okay. me a doctor, please, and small gloves. Yes. Okay. Knock, knock. Mm -hmm. Hi. 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 We spoke on the phone. Yeah, thanks oh. for coming. Hi, I'm Clem. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You look beautiful. Hi, Thank I'm you. Yvonne. It's okay, we hired them to photograph the bird. Yeah, we, we paid for this. We just yeah. wanted to document the right high. Big day. Okay. Big day. Thanks. You look great. Your ad says that you're discreet. Absolutely. We had some ideas for some of the pictures we got. Okay. Oh, this is beautiful. Uh, film noir kind of thing. I mean, Do you like that, Sri? This is uh, in case you guys want to have a little fun. Oh, I love this one. Just some candid shots would be great. Will you just stand by the monitor? That's great. Sure. I love that. Oh, I love that. You have great bone structure. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Great. Okay. Oh. Oh. We're right under her. This is great. This is great. This is money. This is money. You know what? Yes. Yes. Oh, that's great. I love that. We should get some props here. I love this. I love this. This is great. Do you like a film more? Oh, oh my god. Eight. Eight. Nine. Keep, it, keep your mouth shut there. No, 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 no. This is great. This is great. Girl. All right, I'm back. Where is it? She's no. right over there. No, 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 wait, I'm sorry. We missed the whole Please. thing. You have to put it back in. Can I you was, put the feet back in? Just a little bit of it, just, yes. the, just the feet. Hello? Hello, yes, this is Caleb from SynthCard. Are you the current account holder of the Fortune Preferred card ending in 6099? Uh, yeah, th that's me. Miss Paulson, our fraud detection was triggered by a recent purchase. Bridal veil is uh, inconsistent with your purchase history. I mean, because we don't have any previous charges in your account to indicate any kind of engagement or, or long-term relationships. I am someone that dates. <laughs> Look at this, meal one, meal one, meal it, one. It doesn't... Drinks one, drinks one. There's a meal with mashed potatoes and chopped chicken. What's chopped chicken? Chicken. 
according to our system, you aren't the type of person to buy a bridal veil. Well, I am buying a bridal veil. Oh, you are? Yeah. Our apologies. Congratulations on getting married. <laughs> I actually, thanks, but I'm just the maid of honor. You're just the maid of honor? You know, you're the maid of honor. That's, that's tremendous. Look how much you're spending on things. Yeah, I kind of didn't realize it would be this much work. Yeah, but you know what? You're gonna look great. Because of the elliptical you bought. Get on there about 20 minutes a day, you're gonna do just fine. Hello? Sandra Paulson. We'd like to verify your most recent purchase. Well, yeah, I, I just bought a new glue gun. But that shouldn't trigger anything, because I do crafts all the time. I'm a premium Etsy member. Yes, but this glue gun is industrial grade. I would suggest you return it. The other ones do exactly the same thing, and you're just paying for the boxes. No reason. Well, thank you for saving my life. <laughs> Hey, I've got a question for you. I'm seeing here that you bought a book yesterday called The True Path to Finding Your Soulmate. You know, a friend of mine told me I had to buy that. <laughs> this friend who's been single, like, the whole time I've known her. <laughs> well, maybe no more listening to her for advice, don't you think? Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> no, decline, is, what, that is impossible. <sighs> Jeez. Okay, I'm sorry, can you hold on a second? <sighs> Hello? You bought enough stuff for this wedding, all right? You cancel that order and you tell that bridezilla she can get her own personalized robes. You know what? Caleb, you're right. You're right. Yeah? Don't you dare. I know, I know. <laughs> Listen, I was thinking of going out to dinner tomorrow night and buying like an $800 bottle of wine. <laughs> so I guess you'll have to join me. Oh, well. You know I'll be there, Sandy. I'm really glad we did this. Me too. That was a lot of fun. Uh, oh, Heather? Sandra, you know what? My shift is ending. I'm going to turn you over to my associate. Wait, what? Hello, this is Ricardo from SynthCard. What's happening? We're having dinner? Wow, you've got your Henry level action right here. Look at that scope. Take a look at that. Wow, what a scope. Isn't that nice? Yeah. yeah. Oh, my goodness. Mm. Doesn't it feel good? It's so good. How good does this feel right now? Oh. You can get a bird, you can get a deer, you can get a rabbit, you can, you know. Ah, uh, I've never felt closer to anyone. Carrie, oh, I got your text. What's happening? Oh, well, you told me to agree with everything the driver said, and I did, and he said he wanted to go buy a gun. Let's just get out of here, okay? But I am so close to getting that five-star passenger rating, so just stick with me here. Okay, hurry up. This place makes me very nervous. I know. I'm sorry. So what's your, uh, what's your favorite gun? <laughs> My favorite? I don't know. I mean, how do you choose? There's so right. many. Right. I know. There are so many. Right, Fred? You That's know. Right. Yeah. Hey, how are you, buddy? How are you? I'm Fred. How yeah. Are you Hello. Hi. This your, this your gal here? This your fella? Yeah. You got a good one here. You do this have a good one, Fred. Yeah. All yeah. right. So what are we going to do today? We're going to load you up? Well, um, do you, do you have squirt guns or? <laughs> what did I tell you about her? You're right. You I mean, are funny. By the way, squirt guns are not very cool. You know what? I, I actually agree because I think it really just kind of normalizes the behavior of yeah, having kids like, around guns. It just No, 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 no. It makes oh. guns seem like a toy and guns are not toys. What you want to do, you know. Whoa. This is a Walter PPK. Now, you want to wait till they're a little bit older and they just be casual with it so that they see that it's... Every time you point it to me, I want to put my hands up. No. It's the strangest thing. Yeah. Immediately. I don't know what it is. All right. Let's get you loaded up. Okay. So heavy. Whoa. Whoa. I'm just going to go look at these. The rifles and stuff. Thank you. Five stars. All right. Wow. Hey, I got to tell you something, Carrie. 
You are the best passenger I've ever had, hands down. I didn't know it could be like this. Thank you so much. I mean, Philip, I had a great day and a great ride. Five stars for five stars, right? Did you just call me Philip? Well, yeah, yeah, it's Philip uh, with an F, right? No, it's Feedlot. Feedlot. Wow, I thought we were friends. But no, you're just like every other woman I know. Cunning, deceitful, and unable to pronounce my name. But you're still gonna give me five stars, right? Five stars, my ass! I went to a gun store with you! I told you his name was Philot. Oh, Philot. Fred, now I'm a 1.3. I'm oh, a 1.3. No. That's how you die, lonely man. I'm from the Napa area. Beautiful country up there, up by the rolling hills. Gorgeous. You should see it sometime. The colors. Nice drive.